Hey all you cool creatures, I'm Cryptid. Welcome to the Cryptid Plays YouTube channel. Today we are continuing Night in the Woods. If you recall, last time it was May's first day back in Possum Springs and she reunited with her old friends as well as joined them for band practice. And after their band practice, they discovered a severed arm, which is only the beginning of the strange events that revolve around them. Now, because this game deals with heavy topics, there are some content warnings that I should share with you, which include drinking, depictions of mental illness, implied death, implied injury, and the occult. And with that out of the way, let's get started. Oh god, she's cute. Also, I love this music. It's really pretty. All right, May. Time to get up. Wow. It's been literally 36 hours since I've been online. This shall not stand. I agree with that. Oh no. Ah, no. What is wrong with you? Damn it. I bet Angus knows how to fix this. Burly singles in your zip code. Something angry singles. Hot chat right now. Classy something. Oh my gosh, okay. He's all computery. I think, but I can't let him see this. Where does he work again? Uh, the video store. Oof. Let's see. Yeah, let's head to, uh, video whatever too. Also, before I get started, I'm going to cut this out, but I'm totally going to practice a little bit of bass. I want to uh, do better this next time. All right, let's head out. Get our uh, computer fixed. Hey, hon. Yeah? Come say hi. Morning, Mom. Nope, I'm mom 24 hours a day. Ha! Har, har, har. Also, it's 4 p.m., sweetie. Well, I'm off to find Angus. Oh, is he your little friend Greg's boyfriend? Big guy, kind of quiet. Yeah, that's him. I need him to fix my laptop. Well, he better, sweetie. You can't afford to buy a new one. Wait, do you even know, Angus? Do you? <laughs> um, I guess we don't know him that well. I'm gonna say kinda. Well, no time like the present. Thanks, 24-hour mom. Seven days a week. Love you, mom. Hey, you kid. Adult. So you're back, eh? Yes, Mr. Penderson. Didn't last long, eh? No, Mr. Penderson. You get a job yet? Uh... Oh my god. I could be snarky, but... I think I will be honest. I've only been back for like 24 hours. Soon it'll be only a week. Then a month. Then your whole life. You're right. 
I have so much time left. No one's forgotten who you are and what you did, you know. They may act like they have, but that's just small town polite right there. Is that what this is? Small town polite's all you got, kid. So watch it. Well, that was really interesting. But I need to go listen to my cells die. Ha! Ha! <laughs> Alright, time to jump on some mailboxes. Yeah, that's right. How do you like that, Mr. Penderson? Oh. God, I love their little town. So pretty. The art for this is just very pretty. Oh no. This was an accident, but that's okay. I'll come back. Whoops. Ah, oh, darn it. Oh, whatever. This is my property. But it's my street. You ain't changed since you was a kid. You're right. I haven't. What's it like being back? Well, I just got home, so... Just like... Taking it all in. Feel like anything's changed. Yeah, totally. Park store's gone. Got a snack falcon now. Food donkey's gone. Got a ham panther, though. The Harleys are bigger now. Saw them running around before. Yeah, I babysit those little shits sometimes. Are they bad? They seem so nice. That's how they fool ya. You know, they steal things. What? They steal things. Holy crap, I was fooled. Hey, I got any poetry from you, Selmers? No? Okay. I remember the time in ninth grade when I snuck out and could see into Tom Bramwell's bedroom. <laughs> but... Yep. Yep, that sure did happen. <laughs> Is me a little peeping Tom, or was it by accident? You have to wonder. I feel like there was something here? Oh no, less. Aha! Arnold Applebaum. Owned the mining company like a thousand years ago. Dad said he was a crook who hated the unions. But we did get a library. That got turned into apartments. Oh, that's kind of awful. <laughs> okay. Okay. Time to move forward. There's an acorn up here, though. I wonder if I can get it. Ghosts. Woo! Clothing ghosts. I love it. Oop. Sorry, just taking the time to explore. Anything new? Doesn't look like there's anything uh, different with the notices. Oh, hey. Hi, dude. Pale white tunnel fish. Easy to catch and so delish. That's good. Oh, God, you were listening. Was I not supposed to? Oh, 
hello, May. Um, do I know you? I don't know if you remember me, Miss Rosa. Hmm, I knew your grandfather. I visited you the day after you were born. You were so small. I guess some things don't change, eh? How did you know Granddad? I'm here most days. Why don't you stop by sometime? And I'll tell you all about him. Things you might not know. All right. You've got my interest. Sweet, curious child. Ah, that's me. Can I steal? Can I steal? Delicious pretzels. Well, can't steal them yet. God, this town's so comfy. I know it is a dying town in the Rust Belt, which is a problem. A lot of mining towns, um, that happens. Better take shelter, here come the smelters. No use hiding, smelters will find you. Okie dokie. I just want my computer. I need the internet. It's more important than whatever's out there. Alright, fine. The greater world just isn't important to you, May. And you know what? That's fair. Let's see if Greg's in here. Adorable. Hey, May. Got cups on my ears. Wow. Sounds like the ocean in here. That's great, dude. You seen Angus? Every night. Yeah, I meant like, where is Angus right now? At work, at the video store. Uh, what do you want Angus for? Got computer problems. Figured he might know a thing or two. He's a hacker. Really? I'm pretty sure he hacks. Wow. Well, dude, I'll catch you later. <laughs> Definitely. I'm so glad you're back. So, that arm, huh? Jeez, yeah, what the hell? What do you think happened? I don't know. How does an arm end up on the sidewalk? In Possum Springs. I mean, kinda cool, but creepy. And like, two doors down from our apartment. You live in Towny Century now? Yeah, we live next door. <laughs> Man, you have been away for a long time. I have. You up for hanging out later? So much to catch up on. Nah, got dinner with the family. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Fair. A friendly thing. Alright. Is it six o'clock yet? Alright, I guess I'll leave him be. We'll head over to the video outpost too. Can I help you? Where's Angus? Oh, he works day shift? Is it day? I got here early? Wait, why does everything you say sound like a question? You do the same thing? 
I just didn't comment on it. Really? Yeah. Huh? Night shift, huh? That's cool. I'm at home with my baby during the day. Until my mom gets back from work. Ew. Babies. Pretty cool job, though. Get to watch movies, eat candy, meet cute guys. Ew. Cute guys. What's wrong with guys? I don't know. Cute guys are overrated. I guess. <laughs> She's not totally wrong. Oh, Where might Angus be? I guess I could go back and talk to Greg. Seeing as he would know. Oh, right. Well, let me talk to Greg first because that is their apartment building. But I don't know if um I have to like talk to him for something special. It's been a little while. Is it six o'clock yet? Okay. Never mind. To the apartment. Hmm. All right. They're missing a button. Um. Hello? 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 I'm looking for Angus. Any idea where Angus lives? I believe he is at number two. Written on the button, I think. It looks, uh, broken. I think the little guy he lives with kicked it in. Rag? Or something. Ow! Beats me, kid. I just live here. Lick. Alright, what happens if I try someone else? Hello, Angus? Are you searching, my child? Yeah. For Angus. You can search all you like for your Angus. Everyone has a different Angus. For some, Angus is a happy marriage. For some, a good career. For some, a fancy car. My Angus is a guy named Angus, lives here. My child, no Angus will ever compare to the one true Angus, the Lord God above. Okay. Dear, have you encountered God this day? Look, my mom works at the church. I'm in the club by default. All right. What about you? Maurice? May. Angus? May? Yeah. You're not Angus. And you ain't Maurice. Well, I'm glad we sorted that out. All right. What about you? Mm, yes. Uh, hi. Angus? Angus, you say? Dude, it's May. Tell me about yourself, Maybelline. Or Maybelline. Whatever. This isn't Angus. Would you like it to be? Nope. Bye. It's freaking creepy. Alright, what about the top one? Hello? 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 You're not Angus. Who is this? Who are you? May Barofsky. What are you selling? Do you get a lot of people selling stuff to you? Hello? All right. 
and this is probably gonna be like okay what there's no button hmm there's got to be some way to make this work oh there is hello ah who is this hi it's may may yeah may i just got electrocuted oh yeah it's fiddly there's no button yeah you can like stick a screwdriver in and well it's too late now uh come on up all right <laughs> Ding, 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 ding. I love that. Whoa, come right in. Hey, dude. Uh, welcome to our apartment. I could have been in my underwear. Hey, dude, don't wear pants on my account. Why was the door unlocked? Greg always forgets to lock it. Greg's at work if you're looking for Greg. I was actually looking for you. My laptop is messed up and I thought... What's wrong with it? Uh, lots of things pop up when I turn it on. What kinds of things? Oh. <laughs> you know, things about things not for kids things why didn't you bring it with you i forgot it Mm-hmm. you know may you don't have to be embarrassed about i'm not i mean everyone i know hmm let me see what i can do Angus is so good. I love him. Okay, I got something for you. Plug this into any USB port and restart. Should clear you right up. It might delete some of your old files, though. Wow, thanks, dude. No problem. Gonna head on home. See if your magic works. It's not magic. It's just ones and zeros. And we're just atoms. And our perception of reality is just chemical reactions. Take those away and poof, there goes the universe. Whoa. Sorry. I'm gonna go. He's really such a good guy, though. Hey, Dad. All right, let's talk. Hey, Dadders. Why, if it isn't the mayor of Possum Springs herself. What did you get up to today? Hung out with Angus a bit. You remember him? Oh, yeah. I like Angus. He's smart. In the old days, I used to work with his dad. I know they fell on some hard times after we all got laid off. I used to see him at the bar. Yeah. After I stopped drinking, I didn't really see him as much. I wonder how he is. Did they find out anything about that arm? Not that I heard. Huh, well... Be careful out there. Maybe I should carry mace or brass knuckles or something. Well, it'd be a shame if you got into trouble and were unarmed. Nah, I think I'll be okay. What? <laughs> okay, I get it. <laughs> Unarmed, eh? 
I'm going to bed now. Good night, Mayor Kitten. Good night. I'll see you tomorrow, Dad. Let's see if this Angus fix works. Can't get any worse, at least. I guess it could be on fire. Anyway. Oh my god, it's fixed. I guess it turned out okay then, your computer? Yeah, it did. Thanks. I put something else on that drive. Do you remember Demon Tower? Oh wow, yeah. I used to play that all the time like 10 years ago. I've been playing it again. They've kept updating. You can grab your old save game from their server and start right where you left off. Oh, cool. You should check it out and we can talk Demon Tower sometime. It's really cool. I am deaf going to do this. Aw, thanks, Angus. <laughs> Tips hat. <laughs> hey, you got that porn off your laptop? I heard you broke it with so much porn. Dude, you know it. Rick Wreckage told me that before the internet, they'd hide porn in a hollow log in the woods. Yeah, that was a thing, right? Be awkward if you were hiking out to the porn. And some dude was already there and you're like, sup, dude? I guess we're both here for the free porn. I bet that happened. You know it did. I bet they became friends. <laughs> porn log bros forever. So, dude, you're coming to the party tomorrow night, right? What party? Up in the state forest. Lots of people home from school and stuff this weekend. Cool people. The big fire. The snacks. The beers. <laughs> Did you mean to write snacks or snakes? I'm gonna say, girl, you know I will. Girl, I'm so excited. Woods are so fun at night. I'm gonna get so wasted. There are no laws in the woods. Cool, well, you should ask B if she can drive us. What? No, I, I don't think she likes me. Nah, dude, she's cool. She drives us all the time and lets us borrow her car. Stop by her store tomorrow and ask, okay, please? Okay, whatever. Yay! Alright, um... I don't think I can actually look at stuff. Like, not, not if they're not uh, highlighted or whatever. Bright Harbor Gazette, Secretary of Education, having public schools is like having public hamburgers. That's insane. Everyone should buy their own hamburgers. What the hell? <laughs> Sharkle. I love Sharkle. Okay. I'm going to check out Demon Tower for a few minutes. In the age of blood, a pale one will rise. Wielding naught but a simple blade. Who dares to climb the steps of... Ancient Doomspire. Demon Tower. Begin. Part 4. Slaughter of the Blood Thief. Sounds like fun. Okay. Ow. Come on, away with ye. Oh no, it's a rat king. Okay, I'm gonna avoid that. Wah! This is so cute. Uh, 
That's right. That's right, you little little goblins. Oh. All right, what's going to notice me first? You. And you. And you. All right. A key! Yeah! Right, you. All right. There we go. Oh shoot, that's terrifying. What? Ah, wow, I beat it. Okay. Level 11, the cellar. Hi. Oh. Um, I don't think I was supposed to do that. Oh, well. Wow, this music is so good. It makes me think of a uh, Crypt of the Necro Dancer a bit. Oh no, the body's still alive. Also, if you haven't played Crypt of the Necro Dancer, I highly recommend it. It's a lot of fun. Hmm. Oh, <gasps> I can't walk into the water. I mean, I guess that makes sense. Uh, I mean, water. It's blood. Alright, I'll probably just finish this level and then be done with it. Because as cute as this is, I don't want to, like, take up everyone's time just playing it. I like their ghost sounds, by the way. They're really good. They are very reminiscent of uh, the sounds that you would hear in old games. All right. We got another key. I guess we're getting out of here. Oh my god, this is the boss battle! Oh my god, how do I fight him? <laughs> well, I died. I think I might just leave this uh, demon tower game here. We have surrendered to the horrors. All right. Well, I guess we'll put May to bed. Bedtime? Yeah. She's so cute. Ah, the music. I love how it's all peaceful and then she wakes up and it's like a little record scratch. That's so funny. Greg has uh, messaged me. Oh, by the way, B works at the old pickaxe so you can go there. Get some tools, lol. Big axe and go on a rampage, lol. I might. I might. You never know. Morning, Mom. 
All day, Mom. Every day, Mom. What are you up to today? Greg and Angus and B are going to a party. So, I might go out with them. A party, huh? Look at you. Back two days and already the social butterfly. I'm gonna go with this. I'm a little nervous. Oh, you'll be fine, sweetie. Get out there and mingle. Actually, I think it's mostly going to be old high school people. I wonder if Cole will be there. I always thought you two were so cute together. Mom, no. Oh, sorry, honey. I didn't know that was still a sensitive subject. It's not. Okay, well, you go out there and have a nice time, honey. I will. See you later. <laughs> Alright, let's go talk to Selmers real quick. Well. And if we don't start getting businesses in here, there ain't gonna be a Possum Springs. So we gotta do whatever we can do to get the market to notice us. And we go back to the topic at hand. Yeah, so we allocate funds to preserve the statue of... Gary, you're not hearing me. Don't tell me I'm not hearing you, Andrew. It's not of sufficient historical note. Your ass is not of sufficient historical note. Guys, 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 stop this. This is the stoplight fight all over again. Oh yeah, and remember who won that one? Can we move on? Fine. Fine. I can legally shoot you for being up here, you know. Aha, <laughs> you'd never. I used to babysit your cat. Eh. So, what are you up to these days? Um, crashing here until I get back in my own place. Parents rented out half the place to Mr. Chazikov. I've been babysitting, interviewed at Ham Panther, waiting to hear back. Oh, my dad works at Ham Panther now. He got everything. Hmm. That guy's working on the power pole. What you doing up there? Streetlight got tore off in that big storm a few days back. Don't help the idiots keep jumping on it. That's a shame. Spread the word to the other kids. Adults. Oh ho ho, I don't think so. Adults got jobs and better things to do anyway. Ah. Anyway, you tell those other kids to lay off. Gonna get themselves or somebody else killed. You know, when they're fixing the steps? I desperately need to get to church. Tomorrow, I think. The vampires can't go on sacred ground. I ain't seen no vampires around here. Except maybe the government. Sucking us dry. You've taken over my vampire story. I'm leaving. Watch out for them bloodsuckers, kid. Adult. Oh yeah, here's the teens. Hey, kids. Hey, adult. Well, I was your age only a few years ago. Uh-huh. Well, see you later. Be careful down here. Wouldn't want to be disarmed. Ha 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 ha. Smell 
Smelter, Smelter's coming for you. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Yeah, Smelter's here. Woo, yeah. Hey there. Ah, uh, hey. Who are you? Wags. Oh, okay. Hello. What are you? Oh, wait. There's a sign. Navy, huh? Yes, ma'am. You ever considered a future in the Navy? Like, boats? It's a lot more than that, but yes, there are boats. <laughs> Can I drive a submarine? Potentially. Eh, I can do that on my own. Later. Yeah, no way we're joining the Navy. You know, I don't want to intrude. But if you're someone who's maybe lacking a bit of direction, that's what brings a lot of folks to the Navy. By the way, this is an incredibly common thing in the US that um, military recruiters will go to particularly lots of young people who don't have an idea what they're going to do or who are poor and have no way to move up in life and basically recruit them to join the military, navy, whatever. And it's not... It's kind of shady. That's what brings a lot of folks to the navy. Yeah, but I have lots of direction. Like I'm gonna hang out with friends. Play bass, play video games, go to sleep. Etc. I guess I'm adding drive a submarine to the list somewhere. Well, just saying. I'm gonna go now. All right now, have a good one. Toodles. Not interested. Actually. Woohoo. I was a pigeon. Hey, Angus. Hey, May. How's the laptop running? Really good. Thanks so much. Glad to be of service. So, like, yeah. How is this store still open? There's a certain romance to VHS and DVD that simply cannot be matched. Really? Nope. Wait, you actually have VHS? Mostly the adult section back behind the curtain. Whoa, really? Yeah, some folks are like really into seeking them out. It's like a whole little scene that goes back before the internet. We had a historian in there last month looking for some obscure video. How do you get that job? I think that's the kind of job you can only have if you don't need to have a job. Yeah, that's fair. So, this party tonight, huh? Yeah, should be fun. I hadn't pegged you as a party person. I'm not really, but parties with Greg are different. How so? You know how you want to just go and stand in a corner sometimes? Yeah. Greg's my corner. Ah. <laughs> Shut up. See you later. For sure. All right, let's talk to Greg and then I'll go find B. Party, party, party! Jeez, dude, you are excited about this party. You're gonna be there, that's awesome. God, what a great week it's been. You're home! I'm home! His little wiggles, so cute. My arms are tired. 
All right. I guess I can't talk to him anymore. So now to go find B. Yeah, Bill. Write it up as on the clock. She's not gonna like that. I don't care if she doesn't like it. It was her fault, plain and simple. That is time extra. We charge for that. All right, then. Eh. Eh. What was that all about? Ugh, don't even ask. Mrs. Miranda has locked one of our guys in her basement twice. Why? Because she's old and she forgets. Maybe if she gets a bill for it, she'll remember next time. Ah. Huh. What do you want? Well, Greg asked me to ask you if you would drive us to the party tonight. You know, the one up in the state park. <sighs> Thanks for clarifying. Otherwise, I might have been confused. As to which of the dozens of parties going down on any given night in Possum Springs you were referring to. Are you being sarcastic? I'll drive. Great, thanks. We'll be by your house at 8.30. Be ready or we'll go without you. Okay. Don't get lost on your way home. I know where I live. No, seriously, go home and get ready. All right, all right, jeez. <laughs> she, I like how her eye actually follows us. Hey, May. What? I was just stopping by to see how you were doing. Why? After the other night, I mean. Why wouldn't I be fine? May, a lot of things that happen around here, sometimes in town, sometimes out by the tracks, sometimes up in the hills. What? It's my job to make sure folks like you never see something like what you saw the other night. Folks like you? You're a kid, May. And you're naive. And in its own stupid way, that's beautiful. But the world isn't. And the world isn't out there sometimes. isn't out there somewhere. Excuse me. It's here. All right. Are you gonna arrest me or something? Because I have a party to go to. Watch yourself, May. I'd really hate to see something happen to you. And being in the wrong place at the wrong time is all it takes. That's all I'm saying. That's ominous. Good night, May. Hmm. I'll have to look at the uh, drawing she has. Hey, sweetie. Look who's home. Hey, the parents. I made tacos! Excuse me, we made tacos! Tacos? Tacos! Do you want tacos? Um... Mm, oh my gosh, um... I want tacos every day, all day. No, I think I'm just gonna snack it up at the party later. Do you mean snake it up? 
Watch out for snakes, honey. Guys, there's gonna be a fire. And people. Snakes will be running in terror. Snakes don't run, kitten. Can you imagine snakes with legs? <sighs> Those are lizards, mom. Watch out for lizards, then. They'll get you. They sure will, I guess. Okay, okay, okay. It's go time. Ugh, I should probably make sure I don't look like a cave beast. Well, what we are actually going to do is leave this here. Um, because the party is a whole nother thing. So, uh, thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please hit the like button. And if you want to see more of me but you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. I upload videos every Monday and Wednesday, hopefully soon to be more. I also stream on Twitch on Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Fridays are usually twice a month. And I hope to see you all next time. Bye!